On a Fox 61 student news is back for the 2020 2021 school year. Yeah, this morning joining us over Skype from Cromwell High School. We have two 10th graders, Brooke Byrne and Mary Kate Sullivan. Thanks so much for joining us, ladies. First of all, how is the school year going this year for you and how is this impacting your student news project? This school year is going good. It took a little while to adjust but now it's running smoothly and it definitely had some changes in this class. Um, and we're like back full time, so we're not in hybrid anymore. So I think the in-person learning is very crucial. Okay, now we're just trying to figure out uh, how you guys are solving the challenges that we have had to solve over the past eight months. How do you get out there and get content and get some of these news stories despite not being able to get close to a lot of people? Yeah, our technology is definitely minimized, so we take most of our B-roll shots after school and at home. Yeah, a lot of the stuff that we do is at home because we can't do it in the school because we have to stay six feet apart from everyone. And if it is in school, it has to be from a distance. What are you guys most looking forward to this year? We're so glad we're able to bring student news mm -hmm. back after the COVID pandemic started. Uh, what's the best part about this? If you could tell others at home who might be interested. Um, well, we are starting our um, student news pretty soon because now we're in school because before we couldn't because we were in hybrid um, because there was just not enough time in class. So I'm looking forward to doing the student news. I'm looking forward to just every day being able to socialize. Even if it's minimized, it's very important to have our social skills and be able to talk to our friends and teachers in person. We agree completely. I mean, Zoom has been a lifeline for us. That's how we've had to do a lot of our interviews, just doing them remotely. Uh, I know you're just sort of getting started, but do you have anything in the works? Do you have any good story ideas, something specifically related to the pandemic or something that now would be easier due to the pandemic? Yeah, actually, I'm doing a story about soccer during the pandemic, and I already interviewed my soccer coach, so I'm looking forward to finishing that. Um, my project, I'm working on being a racer and racing during the pandemic. So I'm interviewing my dad, who is a race car driver, and the changes he's going through being a racer during the pandemic. Wow, those both sound like fabulous stories. Really looking forward to seeing them. Thank you guys so much for joining us this morning, and we wish you the best of luck as you adjust to high school in this new way. <laughs> Thank, Thank you, you so, so much for having us. us. <laughs> Brooke Byrne and Mary Kate Sullivan uh, from uh, Cromwell High School. Thank you so much again. And folks, remember, if you would like to participate in our student news program, it's simple. All you can do is just email studentnews at fox61.com.